Hey, what's going on? This is Rob from Panther and today I'm going to show you how to create letters with stripes. All right, so it's a very simple process. Just select the type two, which is located right here. Click. I'm going to, let's say I'm going to select the letter R because it's a little bit more complicated and it's a really good idea to select a tin font. Okay, so I'm going to go with Monsterette. It's a free type you can download and you can see here the thinnest version or the black version. So we're gonna select the thin, go to object, expand, click OK. And you know, we, we just gonna, we just need to swap it to um, stroke. So we're at the fill right now, I'm gonna swap it to stroke and make sure you don't have anything on the field. Click on the field and then click on the none so you can see this red line. And then click on the field so the field is going to be on the top. And we're gonna need to remove some of the elements in here. So I'm gonna select the direct selection, direct selection tool. And I'm gonna select an anchor point from the interior of the letter R, which you can see this empty space. I'm gonna press delete and delete again. And as you can see, we got these difficult areas. I'm gonna select this anchor point, press delete, Delete. gonna click on this anchor point drag it here so they connect it so we need to create this uh, thin line trick where we're gonna apply the effect uh, same thing here I'm gonna delete this one this anchor point I'm gonna select this anchor point and go here where we're gonna cut this anchor point so this anchor point is cut into pieces uh, I'm gonna right click on group and select this one wait a sec we need to release compound path again so now they are separated correctly so I'm gonna select the pen tool again click here and connect these two as you can see we have a stroke letter right now so I'm gonna select right click group and from here of course I'm gonna add a white so from black we're gonna go and make it white and from here we're gonna go to effect 3d extrude and bevel and here we add some uh, what is that extrusion right and we need to increase the extrude depth a little let's say let's say 200 is pretty good so we're on, we're on white color and this is how it's gonna look in gray so I'm gonna click OK first. We got this going on. And from here we also can, uh, you know, change the stroke thickness. So this is going to disappear. I mean, it's gonna get a little bit smaller. From here we can also decrease the stroke. So we're at 0 0.25. Okay, we're gonna create some lines. So make sure you're on the fill and not on the stroke now. So we're gonna swap it to the fill. I'm gonna select the black color select the rectangle tool create a line and from here press and hold alt drag it down also press shift so we created a new copy I am gonna make this white select both press and hold alt drag it down also press shift there you go and do it again and again all right I'm gonna delete this white so yeah this is pretty good and go to the symbols if you don't have the symbols usually this is not activated go to windows and select the symbols which is located right here and just drag this into the symbols you can rename it lines there you go and you can delete this one go back to the letter and uh go here where the appearance is so in the appearance panel you can find the effects which you basically added if you don't have the appearance the same thing go to of windows and select appearance yeah exactly and here's the 3d extrude and bevel go to map art and here you can see the shapes we got 21 sides so uh, this side is right here the red highlight we don't need this one so I'm gonna search basically for these font shapes I think this one is one of those and then actually this is not this is in the opposite side so I'm gonna clear this and go oh yeah this one is the interior so I'm gonna go to the lines and scale to fit and this is basically how you, how you do it with the rest of them also so check it out for example I'm gonna select this one and it edit here so we're gonna speed this up okay. 
and yeah click OK and then click OK again so yeah this is how you make a uh, letter made out of uh, stripes and lines so yeah thanks for watching and if you're new on the channel don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified with daily updates and also check out the rest of the videos have a good one bye bye